so this is Allie, Allie Cat, is, or, or you want to call her Allegheny. I think her name is Allegheny officially, but we like her Allie Cat. We need to have a little shop cat, studio cat. Anyways, we're t visiting with uh, Daniel. He is with the Eagle County Animal Shelter, and um, we brought a cat in today that's potentially up for adoption if, if you guys can find the right family for her. So thanks for coming in today. It's been a, a busy week down there at the shelter or what? It has been a busy week. We were dealing with an animal that was attacked earlier this week. Um, so that just happened recently. It did, and well, they brought it into Vail Valley Animal Hospital for treatment. Uh, Dr. Charlie. Yes, Dr. Charlie Meunier. Uh, she is still there. Her name's Bella. Um, she was attacked by a large dog, um, pretty severely, and Dr. Meunier was able to take her in and care for her. Uh, and the, the dog will be fostered by one of the vet techs there, we believe. Oh. Um, but we're really there looking. She is right there. Yeah. And we're, we're really looking to help raise some, some money so we can get her the treatment that she needs. Oh, poor little princess, huh? Yeah. So what kind of dog was she attacked by? We was don't it? know. You know, it happened outside of our county. We're working with Lake County currently to try to figure out what the, the dog that attacked her and things like that. But um, at this point, it was a large dog. And, um, and she's yeah. a small dog. She's tiny, yeah. And that's the, that doesn't work well together, does no, it? No, it caused a lot of injuries. So. Oh, I hope she's going to be okay. You think she's headed on the road to recovery? Uh, she is, and we're just we're here hoping that the community can kind of help. They can donate to Vail Valley Animal Hospital. They have a nonprofit called the Megal, Megan Councilman Fund. Yep. Uh, and they can also donate to the Eagle County Animal Shelter, and we can make sure that money goes straight to Bella's recovery. Well, let's say a prayer for Bella today. Mm -hmm. That's right. Uh, because uh, we want to make sure that she turns out just fine. Absolutely. And, um, and she will be. I'm yeah. sure she will be. She's in good hands. She's in there. the best of hands, yeah. for sure. Um, so you have some pets up for adoption. Obviously, we have Alley Cat right here, who's she's feisty. She doesn't like my cold hands, I don't <laughs> think. She wants to climb around, but I'm going to let her come to you and say hello. So Allie has been with you for a little while? She's been with us for about two weeks. Um, uh, she's recently been spayed. Uh, she has a microchip. She comes with 30 days of free pet health she's insurance. She's got a microchip. Yeah, oh, yeah. So if she's cruising around and happens to get picked up by one of the animal services officers, we can get her home pretty quickly. See, yeah. that's pretty, is that pretty important now? Probably when you guys send pets out that are adopted, mm -hmm. it's probably a big part of the process. Absolutely. It's got to be. It's every, every animal that gets adopted, dog or cat, I should say. We don't microchip like lizards and things like that, snakes. Um, but we do, we do with dogs and cats. Um, so she's, she'll have uh, 30 days of free pet health insurance and a free vet exam within the first seven days. But she's extremely friendly. She did really well in the car ride down here. Yep. Um, people were looking at me with her on my shoulder while I was driving past, but other than that. I mean, being in here, she's probably a little curious about all the lights and what's yes. going on with the camera and all these people talking and staring at her. Yes. Um, so it makes her a little bit nervous, but she does seem like a love. She is. She's awesome. And then you have some other animals down there and you're looking for volunteers all the time, right, we, aren't you? We do. We have quite a few dogs right now. Um, so if people are interested in adopting, fostering, or coming down to volunteer, uh, we're there for them. So uh, we just did our last orientation, uh, or the one for January, excuse me, yep. uh, on the last Saturday and then we have a few more you can check our website out uh, we have the la next six months planned actually for volunteer orientation so sounds yeah. good yeah sounds good so if you're interested in adopting or you want to sign up for uh, some time to spend with Allie or if you want to donate some money for Bella's recovery you can mm -hmm. go to the Vail Valley Animal Hospital uh, to do that you can also go to the Eagle County Animal Shelter to find out more about the pets that are available and what the process is absolutely Daniel thanks for being here today. thank you Allie, thanks for being here today. Uh, Leo's got a giveaway next with our watch and win, so don't dial yet, but get your fingers ready on the phone. Here we go with your watch and win next.